Legend of Total War here with part 70 of my uh, Europa Barbarorum Let's Play campaign as the Seleucid Empire. Previously, we took Taras from uh, the Romans, and really that's about it. Now it's time to retake Alexandria Ariana away from the Bactrians. So we can really only, like, get one battle done per episode, because I'm trying to keep these episodes under half, well, around half an hour, because... So far, ever since I've done that, I've gotten no crashes. It just, eh, there's always a high chance of, of crashing in this game, so... You know, if I play for an hour, and then it crashes, I lose half the video. Alright then, so we got a load of archers. I probably should have checked to see what they had. So, right, all right. so, first thing we should do is there's a nice small wall here. This is another reason why I didn't want to build up my walls. It makes it a lot easier to retake the settlement if it gets lost. Stone walls would not have protected me against this army. So let's see... What's this? Okay, get in a bit closer there. Really good that we've, um, oh, hang on, those are archers there. That's okay, we'll, we'll shoot them. It's really good that we've caught this army inside the city, but we can wipe it out. Well, I don't know if it's actually really good. I mean, we've still got some pikemen we'll need to deal with, and of course, fighting with my pikemen inside of a city is often shit. But, well, whatever. It's not too far to get these guys retrained if we need to. That's the general right there. If we can kill him, that would come in handy. So these archer spearmen don't have as much range as the others, is that right? Well, whatever. We haven't lost anyone yet, I think. It really would be good if we did shoot some of their pikemen, I think. I should probably focus on that, because, you know, they give me the hardest time. Pikemen versus pikemen. Because that's the... They're very defensible, these guys, so... Uh, I mean, my pikemen should easily be able to take out their cavalry. General's almost dead, that'll help. Ah, oh, come on, stay where you were. Would have liked to have killed them, but then again, we're shooting them in the back. Can't complain about that. Mm, I can't exactly stand here, these towers will shoot them. This guy, why didn't he move? Idiot. Okay, what I'll do is move them over here. They should be able to shoot even from this range, and we should be able to stay out of range of their towers. He's shooting over here. Ah, oh, getting shot by towers a little bit. But that's okay. It's only a little bit. Okay, that appears to be its 
max range there, so if we set up there, we should be alright. Alright, tell me you're shredding these guys. Good. And how are we going over here? I mean, they're all just native phalanx. It's not like it's a like elite phalanx or anything, so we should be alright. When we get down to it. That's it. Shoot the shit out of them. Alright then, so, 38%, that's pretty good. We're not out of ammo yet. Almost, though. Get in a little bit closer over here. Well, this was the easy part. I mean, it'd be good if we could have killed them all with archers, but, you know, really the archers are just there to thin them out at the beginning. These guys have been destroyed. That's, that's really good to get rid of their pikemen like that. Because, like I said, their pikemen's going to be the hardest thing to deal with. What are these? Just crappy spears, I guess. I mean, you've really used up any of your ammo. What's going on with you? Half the army killed, just with the archers. And they did it in good time as well. So only you've got ammo left. I guess you're just not in a good spot. Um, come over here. They seem to be doing alright shooting, so... Make some room for you.
Okay, all these guys here are out of ammo, so they can stand back now. I'm quite happy with what they did it. This one here gained some experience as well. The more experience they get, of course, the better. Yeah, if you can get these archers to have like nine experience, then they can they can shred through armor. I mean, they don't have armor-piercing shot, but it's just that their shots just uh, do more damage. Yeah, you know what? Shooting that is not a priority. Come on, move it. Don't worry about them. Shoot these. This is what we need to be killing, not, not stupid axemen. They're not going to be a problem at all. Yeah, they don't have as much range as Persian archers. So that's why I guess they're a little bit cheaper. Just out of curiosity. Same missile attack. The thing is though, these guys are actually really good at fighting cavalry. And for an archer unit, that's quite important. Especially if you're lazy, like me sometimes, and just like, ah, oh, I'm about to get charged by cavalry. Right, let's start getting everyone inside. I'm not getting them in the t phalanx formation just because there's no need right now. Every one of them that we kill might end up saving two of my phalanx units. Okay, no, don't worry about that then, just go after them. You get over here. Stop, you're gonna to need to get into pike formation. Pike it up. Hurry up and get in formation like quickly, because here they come. Make sure they don't get away. They did alright, I suppose. Okay, so we've just hit halfway there. But it's still, the, the melee part is the biggest grind. Shooting them is quick. It's just that we ran out of ammo. So we've got 181 of them, without a general. So this is in the general's dead. Let's see how they go up against 239 of mine. Now, they should be roughly the same quality. 18, 19, 18, 19. Why do we... Oh, okay, so we've got um, these two bonuses, but they've got more experience. That's all right. Turn all my guys off guard position. My guys are doing alright. Right, you come over here because they'll probably break soon. You need to run them down. Don't worry about them, just whatever. Damn 
they're not breaking. I need both of you. Oh, shit. Not you. Get out of Phalanx mode and just charge into them. Yeah, just, just stop here. Focusing on this at the moment. Good. Only 40% to go. Roughly. You guys come over here. Let's get this organized. What's this? Hellenic native phalanx. Turning their back to the enemy like a bunch of shitheads. Okay, no, they're doing alright now. thing I hate about pikemen, apart from everything, they require constant babysitting. Persian archers. Um, you might be better off fighting them. They'll, they'll handle them. Because if they're out on the, um, outside of here, then we could be able to break them. And even then, you should be able to fight them just fine. Just go and kill them. off on us. And then you guys hurry up over here. Come on, if they break, I want you to be able to catch them all, so get, cut them off from the town square. Okay. 
Apparently using alt attack. Yeah, change their weapon. Apparently this is uh, better. Maybe once these guys get close, they'll they'll get scared because they're seeing their troops run away. There's my general there. He doesn't seem like he's in that much danger. Get over here. Deal with them before they before they wreck my cavalry. They finally break. Can I actually get some kills in on them though? Yeah, getting a few. Oh good, these guys here broke as well. I prefer you get rid of them. Guys, just make a run for it over here. Well, what are these? Persian archers, spearmen. I would have liked to have ca uh, caught them, but whatever. Can't catch them all. Okay, get away from that. Tell me you're safe. Yeah, you're safe. You know, for running, you're going really slow. them off and kill them. This battle actually has gone really well so far. We haven't had any massive glitches. but here's our opportunity to go and kill some of them. So stand over here, so you can get the pike formation. You know, once you set up, but, you know, move it quickly. Then go after these down because they're shooting at us. Okay, quickly, Pike's down. Oh, he's gonna twirl around, is he? Alright, you can run over here. Almost done here. Yeah, we're getting there. We're not careful this guy's gonna lose, so we gotta move move quickly. Really crack into their flanks. Okay, 
He's losing them quickly. He might end up getting wrecked, but that's fine. They're completely surrounded now. They would have broken if they were outside the town square. Crawling around, just get in there, kill them. Your job is to keep them back, and your job is to push, keep pushing forward. This one here, they're not in their phalanx formation, but it's fine because they're pushing them into these. And that works for me. It's fine. Still a unit over here, but it's broken and stuck, so I wouldn't bother with it. That went quite well. Good kill ratio there. And that will cripple the bloody, uh, the Bactrians. They've only got one good army left. And it's not near their capital. So if we can take their capital, it'll just turn rebel, we don't have to worry about it anymore. Glorious victory! Settlement captured! Hmm, I'd make a lot of money by enslaving them. It's a large city. I'm pretty sure there's still a lot of things here that I can build, so yeah, I will enslave them. Well, the Bactrian built a level 1 government there. Thanks for that. That's really useful because I could only have built a level 2. We can retrain these guys right here. That's perfect. Although I did just enslave them. Oh, you know, the population here is alright. Good, we can keep, we can keep moving next turn. I've got a bit of money, let's spend that, and then I'll end the video there. Yeah, I think it's important that I actually build something here. But what are we going to build? So let's see. What can we recruit from this region? Yeah, we're going to need uh, garrison units.
A lot of mercenaries available here. Public order here should eventually be okay. So yeah, you. Now's, now's your chance. Get down here quickly. If we can take Kofun. The war will be over very quickly. And then we can just go and take all the rebel regions out here. And then we don't even need any more soldiers apart from Garrison in any of this area. You guys have a bit of a walk to do. Keep that to retraining. So yeah, we can recruit a bit of stuff. Um, let's see. Get them. I mean, they're totally useless in regard to fighting, but uh, they'll make for good public order eventually and keep the population down. All right, with that, that's the end of this episode. So like and subscribe, part 71's next, and don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.